I know this is a very overwhelming process for everybody and I'm here to walk you through it. The products are safe for the entire family to use. They are pesticide free, so even pregnant women can use the products. So step one, you're gonna make sure the hair is dry and detangled. And this is the part where you're gonna apply the serum. And so the serum works as a suffocant for live bugs. Now the serum, you're gonna shake it up very well and apply it to dry hair. And you want to completely saturate the hair from roots to end. Now, if your child does have longer, thicker hair, you're probably gonna need two elimination kits because if it's not completely saturated, that bug will not be suffocated. You're gonna work the serum from roots to end. And once you've completely saturated this serum, you're gonna let it sit for 15 minutes. Make sure that you do give your child a paper towel just to wipe any drips. And you'll wanna lift between layers to make sure it gets all over the hair. Now we've let this sit for 15 minutes, so it's time to start the mousse process. And we're gonna put the mousse right on top of the serum. I'm just gonna have you turn a little bit. And the mousse, what it does is it's enzyme base and it helps break down the protein of the knit so they release and comb out. This part you definitely want to make sure that the layers are lifted and we're getting between them. Saturate the hair at the roots and then pull the mousse down. This mousse is gonna sit in there for five minutes and we're not gonna wash any products out of our hair. Now I'm ready for my second application. We're gonna let this application sit an additional five minutes. We're not gonna wash out. Now that our second five five minute application has processed, we're gonna clip up the hair and start the combing process. And so you're gonna wanna clip the hair up and have a larger section of hair hanging down. And that's what we're gonna comb through. You're gonna wipe the debris off on paper towels. And so I start with the comb parallel to the head and comb through large sections, wiping debris off on paper towels. You don't have to scrape the scalp, you're gently running across it, moving different directions throughout the hair, and once again, wiping off. You know when to move to the next section is because you'll start getting clean swipes on that paper towel, meaning no nits or bugs coming out. Now to move on to the next section, you simply separate the hair Pin it back up and start combing. Make sure that you do overlap from the bottom section to the top. Now really if you have finer hair you're going to want to make sure the bigger the chunks the better to be honest and so really make sure that there's large sections moving through the comb because that's what's going to get stuck is those nits between those teeth. And you're just wiping debris off on paper towels as you're wiping. Now for follow-up, what am I gonna do tomorrow? Well, you're gonna repeat step two, which is the mousse process daily until you get two to three clean comb outs in a row. So you're gonna wet the hair down, apply the mousse, do your two five minute applications and comb out. And so you'll do that every day until you get two to three consecutive clean comb outs, meaning no bugs, no nits coming off on the paper towel.